my man's grandma is a fiend. Okay, this dude, this dude from Chicago, his grandma gets so high, and she is like, and she doesn't have anything to do during the day, so her trips are like next level. Um, <laughs> she she didn't have to worry about going to work. She didn't have to. Why wouldn't you when you get older? Like, why not just see what happens? I don't know. Her, her trips, I, I don't, I can't imagine. So anyway, the first time that she got high was from a brownie she didn't know was a wee brownie. And, Perfect. He, and so, you know, she went into. So she just his, kept eating brownies chasing that high and she's like, they never got me there. No, no. Imagine, you think your grandma loves to bake now. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway she went into his little stash of brownies or whatever thinking mm -hmm. like oh i'll just sneak one and mm -hmm. then he had to sit her down after he realized she ate one because he realized she ate one because she started talking real weird <laughs> mm. and she and and i think that also when you're old and just your track your your train of thought is going to be so different than when you're a bit younger that there's a little bit of of when people are already older there's a little bit of how they talk to you that makes you think they're high to begin with right like, i definitely when i used to visit my grandmother in the nursing home and i talked to other people like other older people i i could you could have told me they were high and i'd be like that checks out because right. they are they are talking wild right right anyway his his grandma eats the brownie he realizes she's eating the brownie because she's just talking about how like um what is it she was talking about how, like oh what i would do what i would do to george Clooney. <laughs> what i would do what i yes. would do to him and then and then oh. she started just rubbing the couch and she was like, I, I take, I take that little bit of beard he got. I take that oh. little bit of beard. I just grab it. I just, I get, I get a little bit of, I get a little bit. <laughs> I'm trying to do it. Don't make me laugh. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I'm trying to do it. <laughs> I, I, I grab that beard. I get a little bit of purchase on it. You know what I mean? <laughs> purchase. I get a little bit of purchase on that beer. Oh, George Clooney. George Clooney. And so then he's like, what's going on with grandma? Grandma lose her mind. And then, and then she was like, and don't get me, don't get me started on that, on on that, on that Val Kilmer. All right. <laughs> uh, she's like, I know, I know he I know he been a little sick, but I can make him feel better. And so he's like, he's like, yo, grandma, 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 are you all right? And she's like, oh, I'm, I'm fine, sweetheart. I've been, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't felt this fine since the eighties. <laughs> and then, uh, and then she was like, grandma, grandma, please <laughs> look at me, look at me. And when she looked at her, her eyes had never been more dilated. Like, I don't even know if we does that to you, but her eyes were just like, boom. Right. Oh. And so, so he was like, grandma, I'm going to, oh. I'm going to ask you something. I need you to tell me the truth. Okay. And she's like, whatever it is, sweetheart. <laughs> oh, feel this couch real quick. Feel this couch. Cause I, cause I got this, I got this couch at 92 and, and when I got it, it felt good, but it feels oh. extra good today. I feel like I'm <laughs> melted in this couch. <laughs> Let me put my feet up for a second. And then, and then he's like, Grandma, I need to know. In, in, in my little Ziploc of brownies, did you eat one? And you're like, oh. Uh, <laughs> I ate three. <laughs> oh. Oh. They was they was just so tasty. I know, I know, I know. You only had five in there, so I'm sorry, sweetheart. I'll bake you some more. But oh, child, I've been. I feel like I'm on the moon. <laughs> and that just got it. Now she's into it. Now she's into and, it. And now she's a fiend. <laughs> <laughs> Especially the fact that it comes because honestly, edibles 
are in the form that old people would like. Like, mm -hmm. make, I, I dare you. I dare you to make an edible Werther's original. Ooh. You'll have every nursing home from here, <laughs> from New York to Cali, will be high. And listen, man, when you're high, hard candies rule. Yeah. That's a, you're going to end up taking way too many of them, to be honest. <laughs> right. Man, I don't know. This, this may not be funny, so I may cut this out, but I love that she said, I know Val Kilmer's been kind of sick lately, which is in reference to his horrible throat cancer. That he's had to have his, his vocal cords removed. That's someone being, oh, he's a little under the weather. The fact that she's like, I can make him better. <laughs> I can fuck his throat cancer away. <laughs> the fact, man. Just, oh, child. Let me just. And then, so she'll, so she'll get high during the day, right? That rules. And if I and had the power to bring my grandma back to life, the first thing I'd do is try to get her to smoke up. <laughs> I mean, it's even better since she doesn't have to smoke. It's just, it's just, oh, just edible. Edibles. That's even better too. And so then, oh. then she. Uh, <laughs> She <laughs> she basically gets high and then just tries to get the mailman to come in and sit down every day. <laughs> so she gets, oh. she gets super high and then she'll she'll try every which way. She was like, I even I even I want to leave a I want to leave a couple traps out there. You know what I mean? Get that get that mailman up in this house you know because ever ever since your granddaddy passed you know i've been getting a little lonely and <laughs> and then she she said one time she was like uh, <laughs> this is this is how you could tell that she was insanely high right she was like um i don't i don't even know what her plan was <laughs> incredibly horny and high grandma <laughs> it's just making my day <laughs> this old woman <laughs> just wants to take an edible and fuck the mailman <laughs> this, is the, this is the greatest thing I've ever heard <laughs> oh, it's, it's like <laughs> It's weirdly both explicit and very pure at the same time. Just an old woman who was a get high and get hers. <laughs> and so, so I don't know what her plan was, Ooh. right? I don't know what I don't know what she wanted to have happen. Uh -huh. But she later told him, who then mm -hmm. told me that she was like, "Yeah, it was one day I took I took one of them little cookies, right? Took one of them cookies and was feeling uh." Your voice is getting me too. Was feeling extra. I, I felt like a Milky Way. Yeah, you know I mean, I felt like a like a Snickers or something. I was, I was smooth. I was oof. I, I was ready to go. So then, <laughs> mailman come off. I've been ordering extra packages, so he had to drop them off, right? <laughs> so I just been I I just been mailing oh. empty boxes to myself to make sure that he has to come by every day, right? <laughs> And so then I see him outside, and so I come, I come outside, I open that door, open that screen, right? And then, uh, and then I just drop a cookie at my foot. <laughs> and he didn't even come pick it up. He just, he just walked away. And the fact that she was trying to lure <laughs> the mailman like a dog. <laughs> Just drop because he doesn't know what the cookie is. She doesn't even offer it yeah. to him. She just plops the cookie down in front of her feet and is like, your move. <laughs>